In Columbus, Ohio tonight, police responding to a reported armed robbery confronting three teens, one of them reportedly drawing what looked like a gun, an officer firing his own weapon and killing him. The boy was 13, and his weapon, according to the police chief now, turned out to be a BB gun. ABC's Alex Perez is in Columbus. Tonight in Columbus, Ohio, growing questions is surrounding the police shooting death of 13-year-old Tyree King. It all started with a 911 call for an armed robbery. This man just had a gun on this white dude on the street. When officers respond, the suspects, including the 13-year-old, police say, take off. They may be trying to cut through one of the side street, which would be Oak Street. With police on the chase, authorities say the teenager pulled a gun from his waistband. That's when Officer Brian Mason fired his weapon, killing him. Oh, he's shooting him. Oh, my God. Afterwards, police discovering the weapon the teen was carrying was a BB gun like this, but with a laser sight. As you can see, it looks like a firearm that could kill you. The case is similar to the incident two years ago when an officer at this Cleveland park shot and killed 12-year-old Tamir Rice seconds after arriving on the scene. Investigators later determined Rice was carrying a realistic-looking pellet gun. And David, back here in Columbus, the officer involved in the shooting has been placed on administrative leave. None of the officers that chased the 13-year-old boy down this alley were wearing body cameras. Attorneys for the boy's family now calling for an independent investigation. David.